Hey, what's going on everyone? Today is the 18th of March, 2023. Coinbase, you cannot ignore this. And one of the things that you cannot ignore when it comes to charts is price. Price is the only thing that matters. It is the only tangible thing that we all can verify and say that is actually real and it's true. Everything else outside of price is hypothetical. It's a guess. You cannot quantify or put a value on something outside of what people are actually trading. When we all come in and participate in the stock market, we're only looking at one thing ultimately, and that is price. Everybody. We're not looking at what the CEO is doing because we, we cannot put a price tag on what he does. We're not looking at news articles and titles of what they're trying to create because we cannot put a price on it. The only thing that we know of a surety is the price of the stock. That's it. So if you just focus on that alone and nothing else, you guys will begin to see clearly as to where price is going to go. Take a look. For example, I did a price prediction for Coinbase on March the 6th, right? So let's go ahead and zoom in here. Here it is. I was bullish in Coinbase. I was telling you all at that particular moment in time that Coinbase was a buy that was going to go higher, right? Now, you guys can see the next day price in Coinbase ran all the way up here to $70. And that is where sellers came in, pushed the price down. Now, the only thing I would tell you that I did not get correct is where I have my support area. I had it at 60. The market in Coinbase instead ran all the way down to $50.50. That's the only thing that I would say my price prediction was incorrect on. I should have lowered my support area all the way down here towards 50. Now, at that particular moment in time, I was paying attention to the trend that Coinbase was on. It was trending. The only thing that didn't trend was these days right here, March the 9th, the 10th, and the 13th. Soon after those three days, price in Coinbase came right back up above that trend line. That told us that the market is still bullish. Pay attention to the price. That's the only thing that matters. So here it is. 17.63% was hit yesterday in trading for Coinbase. Now let's take a look at this though. Can we say that price in Coinbase is still bullish? Yes, we can. Is Coinbase still trending? Yes, it is. That's it. That's the only thing we need to know. Now the next thing that we need to find out is, okay, if the price is still bullish in Coinbase, how high are we going to look for the market to go? Don't worry about it because the chart gives you that answer as well, too. This is all a game of probabilities. There's no guarantee that the market will always do what you expect it to do. So you always got to have at least some margin of error. Now, this is where the potential area that Coinbase is going to see price run, given the current price action. OK, so I would say it's around 82 to 80 dollars. We're already at 75 now. So in the next five dollars, you need to be prepared to see sellers come into market in Coinbase. Now, this is on a daily chart. What I'm going to show you on the weekly chart will let us know what is the likelihood of the buyers taking out that area. Because look at this weekly price bar here in Coinbase right there. This one weekly price bar, the price action has taken out what the last six weeks five weeks of price action to where the market merely consolidated during those five weeks. We have now exceeded that spread that tells you that the market is trying to move and is trying to go up. If the market truly was weak in Coinbase, it would have gone down instead, but it went up. Follow the charts because charts don't lie. Check this out. This is the two weekly chart. OK, so every price bar that you're looking at now is two weeks worth of price action. OK, now I know a lot of people are fearful. I know a lot of people are scared and nervous. You don't have to be if you just simply look at the charts. OK, I know a lot of people are trying to say that the market's going to crash and we're going to see a 20 percent, 30 percent fall in price. This is not what we're seeing in Coinbase. You need to treat every market differently. Because you're not having the same participants in one stock doing the same thing in another. Coinbase is bullish. Now, in the next six days and three hours, 
looking at this two weekly price bar, if it closed the way that it looks right now, then I'm looking for the market in Coinbase to run up towards 90, maybe even $100. Yes, but we got to get the market six days. OK, so I'm just throwing it out there because this two weekly price bar is going to look totally different in the next six days and three hours. I want it to look the way that it looks now. But if it doesn't, then we might as well just take away Coinbase running up to 100. OK. Now, the reason why I say that is because these three two weekly price bars is indicating that sellers were more present than the buyers. Right. But on the conclusion, this current two weekly price bar. It tells us that the buyers bought up all of the selling that occurred the prior six weeks. That's what it's showing right now. But let's say at the end of the next, let's say at the end of this upcoming trading week, that Coinbase looks the way that this two weekly price bar looks, then this is massive sell. I'm just going to keep it real. If this two weekly price bar looks the way that this two weekly price bar looks, market is emphatically a bigger sell than it is a buy. Be prepared for that. But until we see that change, we're going to look for the price in Coinbase to continue to trend higher. So I'm done. I'm going to go ahead and continue to look for price and Coinbase to go higher. Um, we're going to go ahead and drop these targets on the chart and I'll let you all go. Now, my main concern is for Coinbase to hold this trend line, preferably. I want it to continue to trade above this trend line. Okay. If it falls below this ascending line, then I don't want to see the market in Coinbase fall below 60. The first target is going to be here around $82 and 45 cents, 50 cents, give or take. That is 9.61%. That's my first target. Uh, my second target is going to be up here around 88 to 90. That's 19 and three quarters of a percent. I'm going to lift it up there towards 100. I want to take a little bit lower than 100 to like $96.50. Um, for a third target. Okay, so let me go ahead and bring up this magnifying glass so you guys can see it. First target is like 82.50, 9.61% right here. Second target is going to be over there towards 90. That's 19.35 up there around $90. And third is going to be like 97, 98. This is due 97. Okay, that's 29.04% run up 96, 99, 97, give or take. Those are my three targets. Now, that $97 target that I have is going to be contingent on how the two weekly price bar ends. All right. So this upcoming trading week is going to determine whether or not Coinbase could possibly run up to around 97. But I am done. Everyone, give me your thoughts. Welcome to the team. Hit that like button. Stay the video. Also subscribe because you're not going to get this anywhere else. Everyone else is making it so complicated. Maybe they're simply regurgitating talking points from other people. But what we do here is literally giving you a heads up. Make sure you maintain the profitability. And as always, trade different.